this is satyanarayan here today we are going to study about fsk that is frequency shift keying so this is the circuit diagram which is explained here there are a circuit with an op amp which generates sin and cosine and it is modulated and finally we will get according to the data input a phase reversal at the output let us implement this before that let us study what is fsk please go through it let us implement practical how exactly we are going to do on breadboard let us see once again the circuit diagram and a block diagram how it exactly works now go through the circuit diagram you can see that a square waveform is applied at the base of the transistor see the circuit is assembled on the breadboard as per the circuit diagram and uh, here you can see uh, a resistors network sl100 and ic741 let us see what are the parameters we have to set for input say this is a, a, a sine wave we are going to give a, at the specification of 1.5 kilohertz sine 1.37 volts and a data binary data actually set at 100 hertz square 5 volts peak to peak since we are using here 741 ic we need a plus or minus 12 volts to energize the ic and it is connected here you can observe now check the output at pin number 6 of 741 and this is the output you can see that the two waveforms are compared where the transition will takes place from 1 to 0 there is a phase reversal it is clearly mentioned here see the phase shift okay so simple experiment please go through it practice let us see some information about fsk for viva purpose and exam practical examinations for more information and data circuit diagrams go to the description and you can download it if you like this please subscribe and press the bell icon and let us see what is behind this fsk fsk is the digital formation of analog frequency modulation and see like uh, some applications here This method is broadly used for biometric wireless LAN etc advantages It allows information to be transmitted in the radio communications It is a quite less prone to error when we evaluate ASK modulation We can achieve a high rate of data transmission using this technique disadvantages it has a very less bandwidth as compared to ask it is a type of non coherent reference signal extremely difficult algorithms are used in decoding the binary information there are at times are extremely sensitive to phase differences thank you for watching